tutorial on this look right here. I'm pretty much calling it like my everyday glam. This is my go-to if I need to run out the house really quick but I need to look somewhat presentable. Um, and when you watch you'll see how quick it is. It's a literally like three steps and then you're done and it looks so cute in the end and I absolutely love it. Okay, and I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Comment down video ideas. I'll link all of my social media down below and if I remember I will um, list all the products and stuff too. Sometimes I forget so that's why I say if I remember to be honest. And I'm wearing the Desio Contacts in the color Desert Dream and don't mind my hair because I do my hair second after my makeup because I have great priorities and I'm going to start off by priming my face with the NYX Angelville Primer. I'm going to start off with brows. I don't really fill in my brows very much anymore because I'm partially in the middle of growing them out and then also I don't really need to do it since normal brow or since more natural brows is what's like in style right now in order for me to have my brows look natural at all I can't fill them in and I like how it looks um be more natural and it really doing my brow routine every day takes so long so it's nice to actually have a break from it I'm just brushing my brows out with a spoolie and I just carved them out with the Anastasia concealer in the color 3.75 I'm taking my Master Palette by Mario and I'm going to be using the color Isabel right here and it is just the perfect transition color. And I just used my Morphe M504 brush because I forgot to say. I'm going into my all-time favorite palette, the Modern Renaissance palette which you can obviously tell I like because peep red ochre right there which is exactly the color we are about to use. I'm taking a little bit of Ray Galar, I believe and then red ochre on a Sigma E25 brush and I'm just going to put that in my crease. After that is all nice and blended, I'm really just going to take this same brush that I used to do my crease and I'm going to take those two colors, Red Ochre and Ray Glar again, and blend that down and pretty much pack it onto my lid. That is pretty much it actually. I really, really love this makeup look. Uh, right now it may look a little bit crazy, but after I get the rest of my face makeup on, you will see how poppin' it actually is. And now I'm taking my L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara and I'm just gonna apply a little bit of that before we put on our falsies. The lashes I'm going to be applying today are actually these. And what they are is a mixture of the Wispy or the Ardell Wispy 600 black lashes and they're just very separated and then literally just the Kiss 11 lashes. The foundation I'm going to be using today is my Makeup Forever H Ultra HD foundation but I really have no idea what color it's in so I can't tell you all of that. I'm almost out. I really need to go and get some more foundation, but for now, this will work. Next, for concealer, I'm going in with that same Anastasia concealer that I use.
Now I'm just going to bake a little bit with powder. I don't even like the powder I'm using, so I'm not gonna put it on blast right now. Um, so just any powder will work. To finish off the eyes, I'm going back in with the colors Red Ochre and Reglar, and I'm just gonna smoke that out on my lower lash line. To finish off my face makeup, I'm going in with Max Gold Deposit and I'm really just going to bronze up my face before I contour. I'm going in with my Anastasia Contour Kit and then this is just the one where I like customized it so I don't really know what the colors are. And I'm taking this color right here, which you can tell is my favorite, um, and I'm going to be contouring my face with really just this Real Techniques brush, but I love to use this for contouring. Like for my nose contour, I'm just going in with my Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer. And this is like the little um, sample, but I do have the normal size. Now for everybody's favorite part, my highlight. I'm going to start off by just highlighting the little things like the inner corners of my eyes and my brow bone. I'm using the Anastasia So Hollywood highlighter. Definitely like a holy girl highlighter for me. If you never got it, you need to because really. Look at that. Boom, put it on my nose. I love my nose highlight. Even the bridge of my nose a little bit. My chin a little bit. All over, really. And that is pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed the video. And if you have any questions or anything, just leave them down below and I will get back to y'all as soon as possible. And yeah, love you guys. Bye.